Today, we are opening up some of our Mad Lab Untamed figures. These are cool little figures that look like there's some sort of little monster in a little vial or jar. See, here's what it looks like uh, a velociraptor or a little dinosaur. Mad Lab Untamed, ferocious at your fingertips. It looks like it has all sorts of slime or some sort of residue in there to kind of keep the uh, little critter locked up, so to speak. Well, let's go ahead and open this one up and take a look at what's inside. Let's see if we can get this paper open. It looks like you open it up, there we go, on this little little sheath of paper on the side. So tear this open. We can take a look at what we have inside. There we go. So this is finally coming off. Boy, this is packed in there nice and tight, that's for sure. So let's see what we have in here. Looks like a little book of some sort. Let's see if I can get this off without tearing it. Looks like it's taped on pretty good, but that's okay. We'll take our time, try to get this off. Let's see here. Okay, there we go. We finally got it loosened up. We do have a little book of sorts. Accidentally tore this one, but that's okay. It looks like we have some other books with some of our other toys, but we can at least see what's in there. There's all sorts of little critters. Geo slime, bio sand. Let's see here. Terra clay. This looks like a little wolf. All sorts of critters. On the other side, we have a lot more of the little animals. These might be the rarer ones. Let's see here. Yep, some of these look the same, but some of them different. And there's a gold gold rush that looks like a rare figure. Looks pretty cool. Actually, all of these look really neat. We've got woolly mammoths. It's like dinosaurs, saber tooth tigers, gorillas, but Anyways, let's go ahead and pop this open. See if we can get this open and see what's inside here. Okay, I'm gonna open that up, assistant. It looks like there's another layer of plastic on there. Let's see if we can get that open. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna peel that off. These sure are packed in there good and solid. I don't have to worry about these breaking out. Let's see here. Can't seem to get that. Nope. We might have to try some scissors. Okay. We got this open. And let's see what we have in here. Wow, look at this. It's really soft, kind of terra clay. It's either terra clay or bio sand, it looks like. Each little vial has a different kind of material in it. Check that out. Looks like it's green and glowing a bit. But here's our dinosaur. Check this out. Looks like a little velociraptor. See the head comes off and you can pop it right on and turn the head. Check that out. That's really neat. That's a cool looking little guy. He's kind of got green glowing eyes. Looks like a little miniature velociraptor. Arr. Got little feet, little hands, and his head moves. Of course, his head comes off. We can probably swap these out with some of the others, which is a really neat feature. We can kind of mix and match our own. Okay, let's take a look at this bio sand, I think this is. Wow, this is really neat stuff. It's kind of like sand that kind of clumps together, and our little our little velociraptor was kind of stuck in there, mutating in there, if you will. That is really neat. Okay, let's try opening up another one of these and see what we get. Right, there's our little plastic seam. Let's see if we can peel that off. Well, there it comes. Sometimes toys have a really strong layer of plastic. There we go. Maybe that's to keep the critter from breaking out of the vial. 
Okay, let's open this one up. There we go. There's a cool little, little scannable piece of plastic. Well, let's get the uh, scissors out here and cut this open now, kids. Let's make sure you let your parents or adult do that so you don't hurt yourself with scissors. That being said, we've got it open. Let's peel that off. And let's see what we have in here. Oh, this guy's got kind of white fur. What is that? He's kind of stuck in clay, it looks like. Terra clay, maybe. It's like a green clay. Let's see if we can get him out of there. There we go. Check that out. Looks like a wolf body, almost. And a little a wolf head. Big wolf with fangs. He's got white and blue fur. Got some really big teeth. He also has kind of some glowing looking eyes They're mutating in his little his little toxic slew in his mad lab. He's an untamed critter. Check that out. He's got teeth right there. He's got cool eyes and black nose. Let's take a look at him. I like this guy. It's really neat. It's quite a bit different from the Velociraptor we just got. Let's set him down here. We'll put our terra clay over here and let's pick up some of this paper. Let's open up another one of these critters. We have these hybrid Mad Lab Untamed hybrid creature. Okay, there we go. We're getting the hang of this now. Get that piece of plastic off of there. Sometimes have to work at this, but you want to be careful if you don't tear the little booklet like I did the first time. All right, got that off. Okay. This one also looks like it has some sort of bio sand or terra clay. I can't tell, but let's let's open them up and see what we got this time. Okay, let me use my scissors here and carefully peel back this plastic a bit. There we go. Okay, assistant, pull that out of there. What did we get? Here we go. Let's see if we can get him out of there. He's, he doesn't want to come out. He likes it in his little toxic sludge. But he needs to come out for his audience here. See the world. All right, let's try to dig him out of there. Can you get him out? I'm gonna pull out a lump of this clay. Clay, or maybe this is bio sand. I think that's clay. But... All right, what do we get here? Wow, check that out. Looks like a bear, a big cave bear. That is really cool. He's sitting down and he's staring down something. He's got brown fur. He's got a little bit of clay on him still. A little terra clay, I believe that is. He's got brown fur, a little yellow fur on him. Some yellow stripes. Check those eyes out. It's kind of glowing eyes, just like the other guys, our other hybrids, our Mad Lab hybrids. Now let's open up our final one. This is it. This is the last one of the batch we have. And I'm anxious to see what we get. Let's see if we can peel this plastic off here. Our little, our vial here. Our scientific vial. Alright, let's see if we can get this off. They're real colorful too. They're really neat toys. All right. This looks like slime. Actually, this looks different. The material in this little vial looks different from the other ones. The other ones, I think, were bio sand and terra clay. But look at that green, glowing slime. I can't wait to get this one open. All right, let's see if we can cut our little piece of plastic off. There we go. Okay. Oh, wow, check this out. Our little hybrid is buried in the slime. He's mutating in the slime. You want to reach in there and get him out? Ooh, look at that. 
That is definitely slime. Whoa, check that out. His body is buried in the slime. He's completely immersed in the slime. Touch that. Wow, isn't that neat? That is definitely slime. Oh, that's so slimy. What a cool toy. Let's see if we can work him out of here. All right, I think we got his head here. There's his body. Check him out, he's covered in slime. Very cool stuff. Put my head on. We got another Velociraptor too. That is really cool. See if I can pull some of this off here. Let's clean up our little critter, our little hybrid. Let's come out of his mad lab. Wow, this is really neat stuff. It's kind of sticky. Probably don't want to get this on your clothes or in your hair. Okay. Let's take a look at each one of our critters. Let's see what we have. And there's the slime. Check that out. That's the clay, the terra clay. Here we've got the uh, bio sand. And here I believe we have some more terra clay. Looks like three different types of slimy residue that's inside each one of these. Let's take a look at our book here. Maybe we can see who we got. Okay. Got geoslime, bio sand, terra clay. All these guys coming in. That's definitely the geoslime. Wow, look at all these little critters. Okay, who is this guy? He's gray. He was in bio sand. He's got green eyes. Looks like Bone Cruncher. T Bone or Bone Cruncher? I think he's Bone Cruncher. Now, this guy is kind of easy to tell. He was in Terra Clay, so look at the Terra Clay section, and his name is Grizz. He looks to be the only brown bear that's on this section. Really cool. Okay, now this guy came in the actual geo slime, and he's kind of orangish a little bit. I'd say that's Blaze. Yeah, that definitely looks like a match for Blaze. So his cool name is Blaze. We got the slime off of him too. And this guy was in Terra Clay, and looks like two wolves, but only one that has blue on him, so he's Blizzard. His name is Blizzard. How are you tell him, Blizzard. Barking at the moon. All right, let's put him back. All sorts of little, little toys here. Well, I really like all of these. Okay, so there's Bone Saw. That's a different one. All right, let's look on the other side. These must be some of the rarer figs. They have a smaller sections, if you will. But there's Gold Rush, the dragon. He must be really hard to get. There's a mammoth. Yeah, Gold Rush is pretty cool looking. Let's see some more saber teeth cats. But enough of that. Let's look at this guy again. Let's swap their heads around so we can take one body and one head and put them together. Check that out. Hey, where's my head? Check out the wolf head on the Velociraptor body. Talk about a hybrid mutant. That looks pretty cool. Let's see here. Who can we put on this guy's body? Put Grizz, Bear's body. His head looks pretty big for that body, but it's still pretty neat looking. Really swap these guys around and make some really cool mutants. These little vials would be fun to play with too. Alright, let's line all these guys. Okay, so there you have it. These are all of our uh, hybrids we got from Mad Lab Untamed. I hope you enjoyed watching us unpackage them. I think we're gonna go play with them now. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and please check out more of our videos at Long Live Fun Toys. Thanks everyone.